What's up guys, it's Ace Unhacked here, and welcome back to part 2 of episode 6 of Minecraft Story Mode. Now, I'm super excited to get back into this, there is a Captain Sparkles, and, little bit of a spoiler, there is a bunch of other YouTubers as well that are going to appear at the very beginning of this episode. I'm so excited, also, just before we start, I apologise, in this episode, uh, well, through this whole series, like, through this whole episode of Minecraft Story Mode, you might notice that my microphone quality is a bit grainy. Something happened to the audio file and it is just, yeah, it's a bit grainy. There was nothing really I could do about it. So I apologize for that. But anyway, let's jump straight into it. Puddle up in the dining room. Oh, is that Dan well, TDM as well? Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. And wait. Ooh, I hope there's cake. It's... is that... It's not. Come on, let's do this. There's so many YouTubers! I think that's Stacy Plays, right? Here, let me introduce you all properly. Okay. Let me see if I actually got this. already met Cassie Rose and LD Shadow Lady. Uh, but my friends call me Lizzie. It is. Stacy plays. Stampy Cat. Stampy Cat. And that's Dan, the diamond mine card. Oh my gosh! When did your hair change color? Wasn't it? It's funny. Before you guys showed up, we all knew each other. This here. is so cool. Their names are Jesse, Petra, Lucas, and Ivor. You said there was news? Is it good? Good news? They all named it. They uh, all voiced themselves! Yeah. It's, um, bad news, I'm afraid. Tork Dog is dead. Is Tork Dog a YouTuber that I don't know? I feel like it is now. But Tork Dog was so tough. There was nothing that could take him down. What happened? Yeah, what on earth is going um, on here, Sparkles? Show them the arrow. These are what got him. Tipped arrows? Does this mean someone set a trap for Tork Dog? That's LD Shadow, Shadow Lady, right? That's Dan TDM. The one behind is no. The one behind is LD Shadow Lady. The other one's Stacy Plays. This is Stacy Plays, right? How can you say that? Is that a YouTuber? The one with red hair? Whoa. Um. Come on, everyone. Come on. Don't get greedy. Just, I want to know what happened. That's pretty cold. Curiosity's sake. Wow, that's a pretty cold question, don't you think? Well, let's just say you didn't know Torque Dog like we did. I guess. I really didn't. I knew him for about so 30 I'm seconds. At this situation, I'm trying to figure something out. Is this just about Torque Dog, or is there a bigger picture? I have no idea. Yeah, why have our portraits? I don't know, guys. Knowing Torque Dog, I think this might just be about him. Am I picking up some beef here? Uh, what? No! I don't know what you're talking about. The invitations about. prove okay, otherwise, why yeah. invite us all here? Yeah. That's true. Hadn't thought about that. Well, someone brought us here for a reason, including Talk Dog. What if we're all in danger? We probably are. Dan's right. We can work Whoever's together. Doing this, they could be hunting us. Hey, come on, everyone. If there's one thing I believe in, it's teamwork. Yes. If we all stick together and get through this as a team. Exactly. We'll be fine. <laughs> Inspiring. There you go, guys. Teamwork makes the dream work. Yes. Teamwork makes the wow. dream work. Oh, all of this danger talk has my stomach all queasy. Stampy, come over here. I need to talk to you about something. Lizzie, psst, Lizzie. The more I think about it, the more I think that there's something these people really don't want us to know. They're all YouTubers? One of them's gotta know the truth about what's going on. Let's gain their trust. I say we talk to everyone and gain their trust. Yes. Yeah, good luck with that. I wanna talk to everyone because I wanna hear their lines. This is so Let's cool. Let's get investigating then. Okay, let's talk to Dan and Lizzie. Hey there, Dan. Lizzie? Oh, uh, hello? Hi there. If you don't mind, I actually had some questions about this Torque Dog situation. Yeah? Go ahead. Why so interested you know, in this stuff? People really interested in seeing Torque Dogs in There wasn't the good. There wasn't why? anything good there. An adventurer like him? He could have had all kinds of cool stuff. I mean, uh -huh. I guess. You disliked it. Lizzie, seems like you're not much of a Torque Dog fan. What's the deal? It's making oh, me think on. more and more he's yeah, a YouTuber right? that I don't know. Nobody liked that guy. I'm just the only one who will actually admit it. 
He, um, yeah, he definitely wasn't the nicest person. Why target Truck him? Dog was clearly targeted with this trap. Why him? Well, he was bragging about having some kind of rare item. He didn't have anything. Didn't show it to anyone, of course. Typical talk dog. He had a rare item? So this rare item that Torque Dog claimed to have? What can you tell me about it? We don't know exactly. Yeah, sorry. He didn't have anything okay. on him. Okay. Unless it was stolen before he died. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks. Hmm. What'd you find out? It's all tangled up, but it sounds like Torque Dog claimed to have some sort of rare item. I didn't see anything like that in his inventory, though. Exactly. Yeah, something's not quite adding up here. There's a cat! Which is a teleporting cat. <gasps> Talk to Captain Sparkles! Hey, Sparkles, and Cassie Rose, yeah? Yep, hi, that's me. Cassie Rose, hey, is that a YouTuber? That um, I also Wendell don't know. Hi too. <laughs> you mind if I ask you guys some questions? Nope, what are the questions? Um... What about Lizzie and Torque? There Tork was drama between Lizzie and Torque Dog, right? Got any insight? Sorry, I'm not getting wrapped up in that. Especially now that Torque Dog is, you know. But it's weird, right? Definitely seems like there's some beef. Uh, not that I um, want to get into rumors or anything like that. Uh, why would someone kill him? Got any guesses why someone would kill Torque Dog? Uh, gosh, gosh. Um, he was a little prickly around the edges, you know? You'd have to ask other people about that. I, I didn't really know him. Mm hmm. Okay. I don't want to say anything mean about a guy that's not here to defend himself, but, well, you met him, right? Prickly is kind of an understatement. Kinda, but... Cassie, you seem pretty upset about people wanting to poke around Torque Dog's inventory. Oh, was I? Yeah, yeah, you it's were. It's her! Why was that? I have no idea, actually. Well, it was just so... It's insensitive, right? I mean, it, it had just happened, and she was all curious about what was in his pocket. That's kind of fair. Just made me mad, I guess. Sparkles, Cassie, Winslow, thanks for the time. Winslow, yes. No problem. The adorable uh, kitty. Yeah, anytime. Get anything out of them? Found out this group has a whole lot of secrets they're keeping from each other. Yep. That's definitely something. Okay, so I don't know if Cassie Rose and Talk Dog. I don't know if they're YouTubers. If they are, I apologize. I don't know them. The other ones I know, like I've heard of before. And Captain Sparkles, I'm a fan. I fanboyed, kind of, when he appeared on hey screen. Hey, guys. Stampy's Stampy really cool Stacey, as well. And Dan right? And all of them. They're just so cool. Hello. Hey, Jesse. Hey. What's up? Um, I know things are a little nuts right now, but I've got some questions. Oh. Really? Uh, but what? Um. Who would kill? Anyone you can think of that would want something bad to happen to Torque Dog? Um, well, I never had that big of a problem with him personally, but I know other people did. Quite a few, actually. You're looking directly at them. I don't know if you noticed, but he was a bit of a griefer. Yeah, and a thief. Mm. Thief, huh? Interesting. Um. Why doesn't Lizzie? It seems like Lizzie and Torque Dog really didn't like each other. Know anything else about that? Oh, that! Real shame, real shame. He broke into her house and stole a bunch of stuff from her. She was super upset about it. Wow. You don't say. Stacy, you seem pretty curious about what was in Torque Dog's inventory. What's up with that? Well, Torque Dog was a pretty notorious thief. I was just curious what he had. That's it. All of these people mm -hmm. could have done it. I don't know. Thanks, you two. This is been... Maybe it's none of them. Maybe it's some other random person. No problem. Yeah, no problem. So, did you find anything out from Stacy or Sturdy Cat? Stampy Cat. Stampy Cat? Yeah. Right, right. So, did you find anything out? No, really. Apparently, Torque Dog was a well known thief. A thief, huh? Well, that might have something to do with it, don't you think? Maybe. Agreed. So, Torque Dog was a thief? And he supposedly had something rare, but I feel like there's still a piece missing. No one will tell me what this rare item is. Did they know? I, uh, I think I can shed some light on that oh. situation, actually. Sparkles! Oh. Now my curiosity has peaked. Oh, for... Oh, just tell me what this thing is already. Okay, okay, I'm going to, I'm going to. There's a temple way out in the middle of nowhere. No one knows who built it, but it's been there 
forever. Okay. People have been trying to track down the temple's location for ages because they want this treasure, it's supposedly deep in its basement. Now, it looks just like an ordinary flint and steel, uh, but it's actually super rare. It's got this enchantment on it. It can open portals to other worlds? We have it. Exactly. Wait, what? You know about the enchanted flint and steel? Um... How did you know that? I have one. I want to be friends with Sparkles. I actually have one of my own. Really? Yeah, I do. Just use it a little no, while geez, ago to put get- put that away. You, you can't just pull that out here. Okay. Uh, you know, I had a theory about why you were here, and I, I think this might just prove it. Okay. What's your theory? What is- Everyone? Everyone? We've all been freaking out, wondering why we were all brought here. Why, uh, Torque Dog died? Uh, and Jesse has just uncovered a very important clue. What? Really? Whoever killed Torque Dog, whoever invited us, they're after the enchanted flint and steel. Ah! Oh! Sparkles? No! No! He's gonna what suffocate! Stampede. It's just. Oh, that's Greetings, creepy. Adventurers, I am the White Pumpkin. One of you has the treasure I desire. I will not rest until it is mine, even if I have to resort to murder. Okay, hello. I'm too cute to die. Too cute to die. Oh my gosh, what? Stampy, calm oh, down! I have no idea. It's just lighting. Ah. Poor Sparkles. Poor Captain Sparkles. Yeah, trapped by sand, that's a rough way to Although. I think Sparkles is still alive and Sparkles is the white pumpkin. That's what I think. He fell down there, escaped, and then the sand fell. He just put random items up. I reckon Sparkles is the white pumpkin. That's why he escaped. How much for a nice dinner party? It's Sparkles. It is so Sparkles. Sound of that. What's going on? What's going on? Why would you open the front doors? Yeah, no joke, what are you doing? What was your name? Cassie Rose or something? Shut the door, what are you doing? Shut it, yes, shut it. Goodness. What was that? Why would you ever open that? Come here, Winslow. Winslow. Be scared. You're adorable. So we're stuck in here. And if we're stuck in here, we're all doomed. Oh, no. I thought I heard Sparkle say something about a flint and steel. Yep. Oh, please don't bring that up again. Well, obviously, Talk Dog didn't steal it. Okay, but who then? Uh, Jesse? What's up? It's already crossed off? No. Well, I guess I'm next then. Oh. Nope. Not happening. I protect you. Don't worry, Ivor. I'll Stick protect together. You. I just hope that this white pumpkin isn't beyond both of our abilities. Well, I'm sure there's a perfectly logical explanation for how the white pumpkin is doing all this. I mean, the whole place has got to be rigged with traps, right? Torque dog, trap. Sparkles, trap. Yeah, we need to find out what makes these traps tick. I bet it's Sparkles. I bet the white pumpkin is Sparkle. He's, he's still alive. He wouldn't be dead. No way. All right, I'm gonna investigate that dining room. Cool. I'll keep those guys in the hall for now so I can keep an eye on everyone. Okay. An excellent idea. Don't want them messing up the crime scene. Well, I'm sticking with you, Jesse. Doesn't seem safe to wander off alone. Good idea. Okay, people, clear out. This is a crime scene. Calm down, Ivor. Okay, how are you doing this, White Pumpkin? Look at fireplace, sure. The pumpkins are creepy as. Impressive. Anything? Nah, it looks like a regular old fireplace. Let's go look where Sparkles died. Probably something over there. Look at the portrait. 
This looks like the exact spot where the white pumpkin appeared, but now just a portrait. Unless... Punch it. <gasps> oh, it wasn't him. It's just a costume on an armor stand with a jukebox for the voice. No sign of how it was triggered. Hmm. Wow. The white pumpkin must have some amazing redstone skills to rig up something like this. Yeah, no joke. But why? It must have taken a lot of work uh, to rig it up. To scare us. I think it was to scare us. A warning. Obviously. Wow. It was terrifying. Mission accomplished. Look at the sand trap. Can I, can I look at the pumpkins? No, I can't. Okay, sand trap. Look at. Man, poor sparkles, crushed under sand. Oh, <sighs> really nasty way to go. I mean, yeah, but I don't think he's dead. I don't think he's dead. He happened to sit in the exact one. You can even see the piston there. Wait, there's a button. Okay, so this was the dining table where we were all gathered together right before. Push it. Okay, let's give this a shot. <gasps> Just like before. Greetings, adventurers. I am the one. Who was sitting there? Yep. One of you Just is like the before. treasure I desire, and I will not rest until it is mine. Who was and sitting I there? I didn't pay attention. To murder. He's back! The white pumpkin's back! No, Don't he's worry, not. Everyone, Calm down. It's just a dummy. A white pumpkin costume on an armor stand. Yep. Wait, what? Why? The trap that killed Sparkles, the whole show with the white pumpkin, it was all triggered by a button on the table. But what does that mean? I am so creeped out right now. Understandably. The killer sat it at this table. It means that the white pumpkin sat at this very table and pushed the button. Wait, so you're saying that the white pumpkin is one of us? That's right, Mr. Stampy. One of us is a murderer. Okay, maybe it's not Sparkles. I thought it was Sparkles. Maybe not. And he sat right here. Wait, but that's not where Jesse found the button before. There's more than one? I'll see if I can find all of them. Oh. Nice work, Jesse. Yes. There's probably I'm one at every single seat or something. There's a logical explanation for what the white pumpkin's been so what now? Feels like we've made some good progress so far though, right? We keep looking for clues. Once we get everyone calmed down, we need to keep looking for clues. So far we found those tipped arrows and these traps, meaning that the white pumpkin is a great brewer and a redstone expert. Yeah. Okay, that's all of them. If you could all please take the same seat you were at before. Four of your seats are marked. These are the seats that had a button to activate the trap. That means the white pumpkin could oh. only be Dan, Stampy, Lizzie or Lucas. Wait, you're accusing us? Wait, what? I echo their sentiments exactly. Calm yourself. I didn't even see a button. Calm hey, yourselves you down. People all just calm down. Calm? Listen to this. Talking about calm. I'm taking charge now, and I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Exactly. I want everyone separated. I'm going to talk to each suspect one by one, so I can find out who's telling the truth and who's lying. I got a whole lot of questions, and I want nice. Little matching answers for each and every one of them. Understand? Dang, I'm gonna go on bad cop clear. here. Yes, crystal clear. Who are you gonna interrogate first? All of them. Stampy. Let's start at one Stampy end of the Stampy. table. Where am I going? Alright, so that's all the time I have for this second part of Minecraft Story Mode Episode 6. I am so excited for this series. I hope you guys are all as well. So I hope you guys did all enjoy this episode. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. Leave me some feedback down in the comments below as well. Don't forget to share this video with your friends as well if you have enjoyed. And subscribe if you are new so you never miss another video. But then that is it from me for now. I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.